We have the tradition of giving the opportunity for our IB physics students to visit one of the most advanced and the most prestigious physics labs in the world, which is CERN, which is located in Geneva. Due to the unfortunate events uh, happening uh, around us this year, we weren't able to uh, execute the actual uh, physical visit that was planned to take place in February. However, thanks to one of our alumni students, Zain Zbib, uh, who is currently a software engineer at CERN, offered to provide us with a virtual turn of CERN for Amitou physics uh, students specifically. This visit will allow our students to, and to see the, the lab and how it functions and how to relate the things that they are studying in IB physics to the actual experimentation that takes place in one of the most advanced labs in the world. The CERN lab, the reason it's one of the most exciting and advanced labs in the world is because it's the major place where particle physics was basically developed. And this is where the, the Higgs boson was discovered. And when we actually make the, the visit, students discover or talk to the scientists who contributed to the actual discovery of the Higgs boson, which in the field of physics is uh, something extremely major. I'm very happy and grateful that I get to give a virtual visit for IC and to show a bunch of young aspiring scientists and engineers the groundbreaking and cutting edge technology that we have here at CERN and how the scale and complexity of the research that we have is used to discover the secrets of the universe. And for me, this is the truly inspiring and beautiful thing about CERN. It's because we have over 12,000 people from all the different parts of the world working on a goal like this. And it's truly beautiful because if you look at the history in the last 70 years, CERN was the birthplace of the internet. And a lot of the technology for MRIs, X-rays and cancer portal therapy came from here. During the visit, IC students will be able to gain a deeper understanding of the theoretical concepts of particle physics and also be able to see how it's applied in the real world. And it goes to show that even in the smallest scales of the universe, if humanity collaborates together, we're able to learn more about the world around us and also create technology that benefits society. It's one of the most advanced scientific lab that anyone can visit. And I think we are really honored to have the chance to, to actually visit it, even if it's virtually for this year. And if I were to give a piece of advice for graduating students and it's to continue being curious, the world around us is changing every day and every day is different. So don't be afraid of failure. Failure is only part of the process and it's what will make you stronger and get you closer to achieving all of your dreams.